This video explains Rubric 2, which is used to evaluate quality of explanation of subject matter and how it should be applied in the OER evaluation tool. This rubric is applied only to subject matter explanation, which will most often be found in objects intended for use by a student. However, even when an object is intended strictly for teacher use, there may be an explanation of the subject matter included. Obviously, for student-directed objects, this explanation will most often be the central part of the lesson or activity. For teacher-directed objects, such as lesson plans, the main point of the object is the presentation of the lesson or activity. However, there is sometimes a side explanation for the teacher to learn or be refreshed on the concepts being taught in the lesson. In these cases, the teacher becomes the learner. These sections of an object are the only parts to consider when applying this rubric. Make sure you are not using Rubric 2 to rate the quality of a teacher-directed object's explanation of how to present the lesson, and don't use it at all if there is no explanation of subject matter included or intended in the object. In that case, use the NA rating and move to the next rubric. This is what the evaluation tool looks like when evaluating a resource under Rubric 2. You can mouse over the numbers to read more about each rating. If an object's explanation of subject matter is exceptional, meaning it is comprehensive, effective, and needs no supplementation, that object should be rated superior and given a 3 rating. In a superior rated object, there is no augmentation needed for the learner to understand what is to be learned and how it connects to important associated concepts. An object will be considered strong and given a 2 rating if it is clear and understandable but falls short of superior and that it doesn't make connections among important associated concepts. An object will be rated limited, a 1 rating, if it tries to explain the subject matter but is not thorough enough or uses a cursory treatment that is not sufficiently developed for a first-time learner. If an object seems to be making an attempt to explain subject matter but is confusing or contains errors, it will be rated weak or of no value and given a 0 rating for this rubric. This would be the case if there is little likelihood that the object would lead to a clear understanding of the subject matter. Again, if there is no explanation of subject matter included in the object, rate the object NA for this rubric. When you are finished rating, click on Save and Go to Next Rubric in the bottom right-hand corner of the page.